I'm David Engel, and on this day, April 16, 1776, John Hancock asked Marilyn to arrest Marilyn's governor, Robert Eden, because his relations with British ministry were believed highly dangerous to the liberties of America. John Hancock was the president of the Second Continental Congress and governor of the Commonwealth of Massachusetts. He is remembered, of course, for his large and stylish signature on the Declaration of Independence, so much so that the term John Hancock has now become a synonym for signature. Hancock was one of the wealthiest men in the 13 colonies and used his wealth to support the colonial cause. Now, Sir Robert Eaton was Maryland's last royally appointed governor and in April 1776, dispatches were intercepted that were addressed to Eden from Britain's Lord George Germain, which implicated him in transactions which were deemed to be hostile to American liberty. John Hancock ordered the Baltimore Committee of Observation to arrest Eden, but the capture of Eden was thwarted by Maryland's Council of Safety, who allowed Eden to leave for England. So, although he wasn't arrested, he was no longer the governor of Maryland. Uh, but after the war ended, Eden returned to Maryland, not as a governor, but to live out the rest of his days as a citizen of this new nation. Tune in tomorrow for more fun facts on the road to independence.